so there were further proposals now to seek alternative uh, alternative ways of actually recovering the trapped miners underground they continue to provide necessary updates on the efforts to retrieve the seven miners still trapped in the flooded shaft at Macrolink Mine in Indola. Management and the technical team have proposed another initiative aside from the divers from the Zambia Army Special Forces. We have partnered with Ho International who provided the solution of using the robotic which is a remote operated vehicle. Um, it's a robot basically as described which can be able to go to those depths, assess what is going on, and even possible to retrieve. They have, however, faced some challenges in the transportation of a robot needed for the mission. We've had uh, glitches here and there in terms of coming up with um, the equipment, having it on site. And uh, probably this is what we'll present to your office for immediate intervention. As initially planned, we should have had the equipment today. Government has assured the technical team and management of its support. I will engage my colleagues, my two colleagues, the Minister of Mines and the Minister of Foreign Affairs to try and see if they, we can uh, talk government to government so that that equipment is, uh, the robot is cleared in good time. He also said affected families will be engaged to update them on the new initiative. So in the light of this, I've decided to uh, engage the families because families are supposed to be on the same page with government, same page with the technical team, same, same page with the owners of the mine. The tragedy and efforts to retrieve the trapped five Zambians and two Chinese miners have entered close to two weeks now. Chembe Mbale, ZNBC News in Indola.